for a, um, obviously not the result that this team wanted, but a performance that can certainly be improved on. Yeah, definitely. You know, um, the scoreboard's not what we wanted and not what we went into at the start of that game, obviously, but we did take a few things out of it. We did some good things and we did some um, not so good things. So we looked at them um, in our review and we know what we can fix. And, you know, um, the more we looked at it, the sort of more positive we got and know that they're little things that we need to fix and um, we just need to be more consistent over the whole 80 minutes. I know it's obviously hard because everyone expects to come out and go, hey, yeah, we want to win straight away. But is it a sort of realisation and sort of the mindset resets to know that this will take time? Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's it's obviously um, really upsetting when we lose. No one, you know, we don't go in the games wanting to lose. We want to win every game, and when we don't, um, it's yeah, it's um, upsetting. Like I said, like a, a lot goes into it every game, every week, and a lot of prep. And when um, it doesn't come off on the scoreboard, um, it's obviously not what we want. But we go back, we look at it, we review it, and um, no, we need to fix some things and. On to next week, um, strive for it again, strive to be better and strive to get a win. This one is one of those things that obviously need to fix in the six agains you gave away a fair few. Yep. Does that need addressing and how did you guys see that? Were you unclear on some occasions as to why you were giving away? Yeah, um, the six agains are really hard. You know, we didn't get too many ourselves and um, a lot were given to them and obviously uh, plays a little bit of part, you know, in and around the ruck there. but. I think if um, we control what we do a bit better um, and you know we, we hold the ball as well and complete our sets, um, we might not give away as many and not be so fatigued in defence. So that's something we can look at as well and um, yeah, we know what we need to do for next time. Head to find the attack coming along, very, very young spine yeah. obviously. Did it seem clunky at times? Oh, I think um, not, not so much clunky, you know, we, we work um, scenarios at training and we know what we need to do in different situations, but, you know, under fatigue and under game, sometimes um, it can be like that, but we all know what we need to do and it's just knowing our role in attack. And I think, like you said, we are a young side and a lot of us haven't played together and it was our first game playing together on the weekend, but we know that'll come, like you said, and um, the more we play together, um, the better we'll get, so this week up against last year's minor premiers and obviously a big one for Baz. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it is a big week and um, Baz will have us ready. He'll have us prepared as, as much as he can and we're going to prepare as good as we can like every week. Um, they are the, you know, premier, premier's grand final. They were in the grand final last year. So, you know, they're a good team and uh, we know what we need to do to beat them and we need to do everything um, we can for 80 minutes. Um, yeah, we can't slack off in any, any area in defence and attack and you know, if we do that, we'll give ourselves every chance and we get an even share of the ball, um, we'll be right up there. I know it's only early in the week, and, but you've known Trent for quite some time. Has he seen any different this week coming up against the old club? Uh, not really, no. I think, um, you know, it's early, only early during the week. We've just finished our review of Newcastle. Um, I'm sure he'll want to, you know, get a win definitely against Penrith, and we all do. Um, so nothing's changed. He'll have us prepared, like, every week as, as good as he can and um, we'll do our best, um, like every week, to win. Uh, just another, like Baz, obviously not too happy with the, the penalty shouts and the record, just wondering how you saw it. Um, oh yeah, like, uh, we, you know, I find the game a lot faster than um, last year. I don't know if that, they did give away a fair few penalties, um, but I don't think, you know, that wasn't why we lost. Uh, we know we need to f fix some things ourselves and the, the penalty count doesn't help, but um, that wasn't why we lost. Fair few drop balls as well. Can you put that down to the water before the game, or is it just a new attack and you know still getting used to each other? Uh, I think a bit of both. There, there's, you know, there's no really excuses uh, for that, but it does happen. Um, and then when it does happen, I think we need to defend it better. Um, we need to defend them errors because they're always going to happen, especially in wet weather footy. So that's something we took took away from the game. When something bad happens, um, we need to be better at defending it. Has that been the major focus today? Oh yeah, it's been one of the focuses. Uh, it doesn't help again with the six against the penalties, dropping the ball. Um, they're all things that we can learn on, and then uh, we know that uh, things like that are going to happen during games. So we know we need to bounce back and be able to defend them. Thanks, cool. Thank you. Thanks.